Hey guys, it's Fiend Frame 91, and I'm talking about Sony. Now, why? Because apparently, now this is just a report. Let me just preface by saying this is a report. This is alleged. It's not something that's been proven. But allegedly, Sony has been blocking certain games from going to Game Pass. I mean, it, it seems like just a business tactic. I'm not sure if it's really wrong or right to do. It's just like um, something they're doing, allegedly. And I can understand Sony's concern. Because the thing is that when a game is on Game Pass, if you have another console, you're still most likely going to get that on Game Pass. Like, I've actually had this experience myself with Bug Fables. Bug Fables, I wanted to initially get it for the Nintendo Switch, but it came to Game Pass. So why would I pay for it on the Switch when I can play it on Game Pass? And I understand that. I do, because third-party games... I feel like a lot of people would rather just subscribe to Game Pass or, you know, get a card or whatever, or rather than actually go out and pay like 70 bucks for a brand new AAA game. Because think about it, Game Pass, Ultimate, let's just go with Ultimate, $15 a month for a year equals to $180, right? So if there are at least three AAA games on that, that are 70 bucks each, that's about $210. So you've already got more than your money's worth if you download three AAA $70 games. So I can understand why Tony's concerned, but I think they're just fighting off the inevitable because let's face it, I remember back in the day when I was talking about how, I think, I'm not sure if I did a YouTube video on it, but I think when like maybe PS Now came out or something like that, I was like, a subscription service needs to basically just be Netflix for games. And that's basically what Game Pass is. It's basically Netflix for games. And it's just hard, I believe, for Sony to compete with that when it comes to third party titles. Because if it's on Game Pass, most people who have Xbox or even Game Pass on their PC, if it's on Game Pass on the PC, will probably not buy it for their PlayStation. Because they'll probably get it either on their PC or their Xbox series or Xbox One or whatever device they're able to get Game Pass on. Even with some mobile devices, I believe you can now play Game Pass using the cloud. So... I understand Sony's concern, but I think they're just fighting off the inevitable. I think just how subscription services are killing it with, with um, movies and TV shows and stuff, I think that's where we're going eventually. Not there yet, and it probably won't be there for a while, but I think that's where a lot, at least, of games are going to be ending up on. Anyway, what do you guys think about Sony reportedly now, reportedly, paying certain companies not to put their, not to put their game, or, or I don't know, but maybe in some cases, games on Game Pass? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Remember to like, share, and subscribe. And may God bless you all.